In this video, I want to walk you through step by step how to set up your Tradovate account. So I want you to first of all know that I am not a financial advisor. I will never direct message you to send me money and I will never ask you to send money in any account so that I can trade for you. So of our commerce, I want you to know that there are so many scammers out there and people create fake accounts and use other people's names. The only way you can contact me is to make sure that you are looking for information on this channel or on my website which i'm going to put down below so from my website you are able to go to any of my social media platform please don't go typing on social media looking for me because people create fake accounts so that being said let's assume that you are completely new to futures and you want to use tradeovate now i'm going to show you how to set up your tradeovate if you've already been approved you are going to have a place like this so when you come here you are going to see start live trading you are also going to see here market replay and then you are going to see simulation so simulation is where paper trading is so i will encourage you if you are completely new this is where you should come and then you are going to start your simulation account the good thing about tradeover is that they are going to give you 14 days for free trial so when you come here this is how your account is going to look like and now what we have to do is that we want to set up this account in order for us to set up the account the first thing i want you to do is just to come here you see where you have this znm5 there is a small x tab there click there and then it's going to bring this up you just close like this now the next thing i want you to do is to do the same thing here close this other one to just like this so this one allow this one now the next thing i want you to do is to come now this is where your chart is go ahead and do the same thing on the chart so click on this one like this and then you close it now you do exactly the same thing and close everything out so you click here and then you close now this is what we have i want you to also come here click on it like this and then you close it so why are we doing this because we want to have a clean chart like this it looks better you see that you have deleted so many things and now it looks a little bit clean but we still have so many things to delete so this one i personally don't use this if you use it that's fine you can leave it there but i will also come here and i'm going to delete it like this at this part down here so let's just leave this for now so what i want you to do is to come here every indicator that is here you double click on it and then you are just going to come here to remove and then we also come here double click on this indicator and then you go ahead and remove so right here we do the same thing and then we go ahead and remove now you see how your chart is looking clean so now if you like your dom on the left it's perfectly okay you leave it there if you like it on the right what you can do is that you just come here you hold this es like this and then you move it here and then you drop it on this other side you see how we have switched it that's a good thing about trade of it because the platform is very easy to navigate so now we have our dom this way and we have our chart this way this is how i personally like it so we come here anything that we don't need we just click the x button and then we delete another thing that i want you to put which i like to put on my chart is that you come here on this plus sign you are going to see trade performance you pull it like this and then you just put it here now this is your performance right here if you click on this performance here you are going to see any trade that you have taken so this is how i always come and click then i'm able to get screenshot right so now i'm just going to close it like this so now you've set up your chart and it's looking good if you want to add anything you are just going to come here and then add anything that you want to add right here but like this this is good so another thing that i want you to do is that when you are just starting it's good to start with mes because mes doesn't move too fast if you start with es it is not really a good idea for anybody who is starting what you want to do is that you come here to this plus sign and type mes as you start typing it like this is going to bring it up make sure you take this first one that is at the top like this because that is the current one with the highest volume you click here like this now make sure that anything that you have here on the chart you should also have it here on the dom so come here also and then put m e s so you go ahead and take it just like this so every time when you are trading let's say you are on mes here you must make sure that here you also have mes because now the chart is showing the same thing that is here on the dom so if you have something else let's say you have es here on the chart and then you have mes here you are trading something different another thing that i want you to do if you come here for example you add nq which is nasdaq you can add m nq just like this and then you have mnq here so what are you going to do on this other side you do the same thing you add m 
and Q. So you always take the first one. And now what is happening is that you have your chart now set up. Let's say for example, I want to trade MES. I'm going to come here, click on MES, and then I'm going to make sure, see right now the DOM is on NQ. So we have to change that and go to MES. So now when you are on MES, before you can start taking your trade because now mes is matching with this other mes this way now i don't like this i'm just going to close that so now if you look at the way the chart is this is not how we want our chart to be you just come here this is where you are going to come and then you take candlestick so now you see you have candlesticks now also another thing is that this is 15 minutes you don't want to be trading on 15 minutes because it's just too long especially in the market in which we are trading now you want a lower time frame so i'm going to come here and i'm going to take one minute so now this chart is a one minute chart this is perfect so now we have set up everything if you want to buy let's say price is going up you want to buy you are just going to click here and then you are going to buy order rejected now i'm trying to buy it's not letting me because the market is closed at this time but that's what you are supposed to do the next thing that you want to do is that if you want to sell you are just going to click here order rejected. and then you sell but it's rejecting the order because the market is closed so when you buy here or you sell here it means you are buying at market or you are selling at market it means the exact place where price is right now that's where you are buying so when you already buy you want to sell you can either say here or what i like to do is that i'm just going to click here so that it cancels everything that i have in the market now the next thing is if you want to put your stop loss you are just going to come here at the corner like this and then you click order rejected so it's not letting me because the market is not on so hopefully subsequent video i'm going to show you how to do all of that but right now the market is not on but this is what you do you just click here and then you are going to put your stop loss after you have bought or after after you have sold and now that is how you set up your trade of it hopefully everything is clear now the next thing that i want to show you is that after you've set up your trade of it maybe you want to start trading and you don't have enough money after you've paper traded right you can also get a prop firm account so i personally use apex so in order for you to use apex so you can buy like their fifty thousand dollars account for 33 dollars when they have 80 percent promotion so let me show you so if you come here down here you are going to see you make sure that you go to the plan that says trade of it i'm going to put the link down below now if you use the code down below you'll be able to get 80 percent off whenever they have their 80 percent off sale so when you come here just make sure that you are on trade of it so let's say for example you want to buy the fifty thousand dollars account then you are just going to come here and click on the fifty thousand dollars account now this is supposed to be the price one hundred and sixty seven dollars per month if you have the code and then it's eighty percent off then you are going to pay thirty three dollars so that is something that you can use from the beginning right and then you train yourself you practice after you've used the paper money now here you have some money because you've put in your thirty three dollars and then you are going to be able to follow the rules that apex has put right if you pass the account now then apex is going to give you a pa account now you can follow their rules as you make money without pa account you'll be able to get withdrawals so when you want to buy you are just going to come here to trade over just like this and then you are going to put your name especially because it's the first time you fill in all the information that they need here and this is where you are going to put the code and when you put the code here it's going to reduce the amount scroll down after you've put in all the information you are just going to click next and then you'll be able to have your own apex account after you have completed the purchase so now you are going to have a login information to log in on trade of it and when you log in on trade of it with the apex login information at that point you'll be able to now trade the evaluation account so it's a pretty simple process and now when you get that you can use this evaluation account to first of all train yourself right you train yourself to become a profitable trader so i would encourage you not to put your money in the stock market especially when it comes to futures because it is highly leveraged it moves very fast and so if you put your real money there and you don't understand what you are doing you are going to lose so much money in the market so our commerce i wish you all the best on your journey i pray that god is going to help you as you learn to navigate this process we all started there i started where you are 
and today God has helped me. I've grown to the point where I've become profitable in the market and that is my cry for every one of us and that God is going to give us the wisdom to be able to understand how to read this market and how to make money from the market. So I just want you to go ahead and go to the comment section and declare and say God I pray for wisdom to see the market in your own lens and I pray that God is going to answer that prayer. So I want you to go ahead and click on this next video. This video is going to be showing you step by step how you can follow my simple strategy and start making money in the market if you want any information from me if you want to check me on any site my website is going to be down below i encourage you to go ahead and check it out any free material that you need is going to be on my website love you all so much